further to holiday 2025 or 2026. Guys, if this really happens, if it really happens to me that this game is coming out in 2026, that would be insane. Well, folks, hide your kids, hide your wives, because it's going down, okay? We got a massive news about GTA 6, and this time, it is coming from a very credible source. An insider came out, not only he talked about the GTA 6 trailer, the teaser, but also the release date. Oh, shit! Oh, Shiza. Yeah, let's actually get into it. Drop a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new, because we cover news like that every single day. But check this out, GTA 6 released it maybe coming sooner than you think and the news is coming from test one too he just went bozo he went crazy and i want to go through this because he dropped a massive post he's talking about the dlc gta 6 released it the delays what happened he first of all said this they're aimed always changing not set in stone deadline is holiday 2024 which has been pushed back multiple times in the past few years Unfortunately, it could slip into 20, uh, early 2025 as well. Bumbaka! We know. We know. Let's keep up Bug 50. That's Rockstar Games' speciality. Uh, they like to wave shark cards. They like to uh, shove uh, the, the shark cards where the sun don't shine. Bruh. We know, okay? But the fact of the matter here is that Jason Schreier, the homie Tom Henderson, they have been saying for years that this game is going to be coming out in 2024, 2025. Albeit, we were hearing that it's going to be coming out by the end of 2025. And here, he says that it's, go it it's going to be coming out by the end of 2024, but it can be delayed to early 2025, which is definitely not that bad. I feel like that most people can, you know, hear about holiday 2024 and be like, okay, it got delayed to, let's just say, March of 2025. If it's like after March of 2025, that's not early, Kaji. Let me know your thoughts on it. Like if you want it 2024, dislike if you want it 2026, because he talks about 2026 as well. He also says this. I'll get to that, guys. Check this out. And there's a teaser image that I will link you at the end, so stick around for that. There's uh, two videos I want to link you. Speaking of which, most companies are returning with a forced return to office policy to revert back to pre ronnie situation days I, I cannot say these words on youtube activision blizzard check this out guys activision blizzard is already met with internal backlash so as essentially the activision devs were like we don't want to go back to work we don't want to go back to the office to work on call Bruh. of duty and guess what they work they work on this one guys that's the skin they, they are working on right now, ladies and gentlemen. Call of Duty devs, man. Love to see it. But Rockstar apparently is no different. Bruh. The debate and consequences of the policy is another topic. Oh, it surely is. Oh, hell yeah. With almost the entirety of the workforce in office, Rockstar could be more firm about an announcement this year. But losing more talent could be it could very much lead to more delays i personally see an announcement as a given this year i don't think the upper management is in a position to delay further to holiday 2025 or 2026 guys if this really happens if it really happens to be that this game is coming out in 2026 that would be insane that would be 13 years okay 13 years Bruh. since we had gta 5 almost as though i believe elder scroll 6 it's been like 13 years or something correct me if i'm wrong and there's one more thing i want to show you as well i gotta link you that video so stick around for that he says that they don't want to delay this game any further than early 2025 and that's a good sign right i really hope this game comes out in 2024 but he says that cutting they are cutting more portions of the game to package into dlcs to release later on and that might be more sustainable for the management than delaying the game further i need your thoughts on it because uh, the the situation here is that uh, we heard the similar situation from tom henderson jason shred that this game is going to be smaller vice city and we're going to be getting fortnite like updates for gta online uh new cities in the future Bruh. as dlcs i want to know your thoughts because we're not going to be getting dlcs for the single player at least the hope is very low it can still happen but i like the idea of that because knowing rockstar they would update this game a lot 50 cent quietly deletes his post that caused gta 6 star we are hearing that sony is reportedly preparing to buy take to interactive i made a dedicated video on this one as well click on this video on the screen because this news is going around or click the video on the left we have this second teaser image for gta 6 check these videos out guys and i will see you right there